the plastic surgeon isn't running up to you and saying, oh my God, your nose is ugly. Uh, let me fix it for you and then I'll charge you later. That's not how this works, right? Like you do not get clients from that. And so you're gonna have a sit down session. When you go to a, a doctor, they literally sit down with you. They say, great, my name is Jeff. I'm super happy to meet you. Um, tell me what's going on with your face. That's how they start, they have a sit down. Uh, when you're buying from an accountant, they don't say like, hey, great, let me show you all the taxes that I've done and then slam it on the desk as a way to qualify them. They don't do that. They say, so tell me your biggest problem with your accounting right now. We'll figure out if we can solve it. No lawyer is like, hey, I just want to let you know, um, we just accidentally sent 18 defendants to trial um, and all of them went to jail. Uh, how can I defend you? Like they don't do that. They don't talk about their results in the beginning. They don't talk about like, oh my God, uh, you desperately need my help in the beginning. They're not showing you the YouTube video of them chopping up somebody's knee for knee replacement surgery. They don't do that. They have a sit down session. They literally do a sit down session. And inside of that sit down session, you get to know each other a little bit more than otherwise. They don't hard pitch in the beginning. They don't say, your business is horrible, I can help you. They don't say, obviously I'm amazing. No, they do a sit down. And the business to business version of a sit down, trying to not talk to like the mafia sit down, right? It's called an onboarding session. Sometimes called a Q&A session. Sometimes called a consultation. Sometimes called an examination. Whatever you're calling it, this is the first 10 to 15 minutes of you talking with a real life client. I'm setting aside the fact of like, how do you get in front of these people? I'm saying you're sitting in front of a real life future client. What do you do now? You have a sit down. Hey, Mr. Johnson, I'm super sick that you're interested in buying what I have to sell. Uh, the way this is gonna work is we're gonna sit down for 10 to 15 minutes. I'm gonna ask you a couple questions. Make sure that you've got a super big problem that's worth solving because ultimately you do have to pay me to solve it. And I really only wanna work on big problems that save money or make you a lot of money. So we're gonna do a sit down, maybe an onboarding session, five, 10 minutes, ask you some questions. Then I'm gonna tell you if you can meet or beat your numbers, meet or beat your numbers. And then I'm gonna show you how much it costs, how it works, and ultimately ask you to make a buying decision. Yes, as a no's are okay, but maybe ain't. Is that all right? Great. Same exact way a doctor, lawyer, accountant would sell you. If you go down to a doctor for plastic surgery, they say, hey, Mr. Johnson, this, uh, they would say like, hey, Mr. Johnson, this is how it's gonna work. We do an evaluation I'm going to make sure that I can best fit you for your nose surgery, for your wrist uh, surgery, for whatever it is. I'm going to check a couple of things, ask you about your health history. Then I'm going to show you how this surgery works, talk about what you get in exchange for money, and then I'm going to tell you how much and see if you want to schedule or put down a deposit. Is that okay? Same exact thing. Chances are you are an agency owner if you haven't landed a paying client. You're running around town saying, oh my God, if only I had proof, if only I had case studies, if only I had something. That is 100% incorrect. No plastic surgeon is running around town saying, hey, let me show you all the boobs I've worked on. That's not the conversation that comes up. No lawyer saying, hey, think of all the defendants I've accidentally sent to jail. They don't do that. Their first step is a sit down.